Hello. I wanted to talk to you about uh, the bear hunt. Uh, I saw a bunch of bears while we walked about the community and uh, I thought it was really inspirational. And in the idea of seeing all the bears, I thought, well, as an artist, why can't we draw some of our own bears and maybe bears doing things that are special for us? Um, I had a couple ideas, of course. Uh, a bear maybe holding balloons or a bear um, enjoying the sight of butterflies or maybe we mix those two together. So that way there would be a bear holding balloon and then a bunch of butterflies. And then of course, uh, in our house and from the art factory, uh, we have some bear props that I'm gonna use as templates. And uh, I'm gonna try to sketch them out real quick, just at least the idea, and then draw it onto something a little bit stronger, color it, uh, with crayon, maybe some oil pastels, and uh, that should be our exercise for today. So the concept is, let's draw a bear because we saw uh, the bears from the bear hunt, and then I can't get that out of my head now, um, the song that we hear all the time, uh, you know, I saw a bear. Okay, so I'm going to try to sketch out, and I'm just going to have fun sketching, okay? So I'm just warming up. It's been a couple uh, days here. So I'm going to draw the ear, draw the head, draw another ear, and then draw the snout. And I think kind of our own interpretation. And then the, uh, some of the eyes. And I see that the ears kind of stick out like this. Now I'm just drawing what I'm seeing. I'm drawing a little fast, but I do want this bear to have its paw up like it's saying hello, and maybe the other paw is holding the string for the balloon. And then it's got its little legs. It just wants to say hi. And if you're drawing and rhyming at the same time, that'll be even more exciting. So my bear is going to say hello, and you guys know that I like to draw little hearts. And then somehow, maybe it's going to have a balloon. So this is a quick sketch. Now I know I'll have to move some things over, but that's probably where I'm going to go, okay? So now I'm going to try again, and you know an artist can sketch and sketch and sketch and then go into a drawing, and sketches are just an exercise, it's practice. I've listened to different athletes talk about practicing and practicing and practicing, and then they have their tournament or they have their game. Uh, you listen to ballet, individuals dance and dance and dance, and then they finally have their show. So I'm going to use all of these here as templates. Now this is a great outside stencil and that can be fun. I can just draw that real quick and um, maybe put a balloon off of that and then it's, it's walking through some butterfly areas or it can be some flowers. This one right here, he's yawning, he's trying to say hello. Uh, that one could be fun too. Maybe that's a quick sketch and then that could be holding a balloon and maybe this bear is trying to let one of the butterflies land in its mouth. I don't know. I'm just playing. And then this bear right here is just pretty fun. Obviously, he's trying to say hello too. Uh, we could have that out there. Uh, I'd like for us to draw our own, put it in the window and that would be fun to find. And then this is, uh, I don't know, that bear is a little, little a little different, so I'll probably say no to that. That bear is hungry. I'm gonna stay away. So I'm gonna focus on these three bears. Uh, that bear is a little too hungry for me. So uh, let's see. Let's listen to some music while we play and try to draw and just have a good time. So I'm gonna uh, sketch out, I think, 
I'm going to work from Miss Lenny's bear and I'm going to kind of make it my own here a little bit. So I went down and I'm rhyming, which is weird. <laughs> and the big mouth. Rawr! It's got its snout up here. Rawr! A nice big tongue. And then some teeth, right? Rawr! How fun. And then, but this bear is trying to catch a butterfly. This is a nice bear, everybody. And then his little paw. Little leg. And then, I'm gonna have his other paw up here. Like he's trying to hold some balloons, let's say. And then I want to draw some butterflies. There's butterflies, you know, in some weird fun way, we have three bees. Butterfly, balloon, bear. <laughs> How funny. So I want us to draw something fun and so everyone can see in the window our artistic version of the bear hunt. And my bear loves butterflies and loves balloons. Okay. So this is a real quick sketch, just something fun, just playful. Now I do want to draw, excuse me, I want to color now the image, but I'm going to take a quick sip of my bear cup and drink a little bit of bear, uh, bear water there. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to start coloring now and I'm going to add a little bit of yellow to one of the butterflies and it is moving some of my pencil lead and that is fine. And then with that yellow, I'm gonna add a little bit of orange. And if you need to sing, you can. And then I think, as a kid, I was always most impressed by the red balloon. And what's fun is now, let's take the red and try in three different areas. So a red heart, a red balloon, and I have to think of somewhere else for red, so I'm gonna hold on to that. Let's start adding some background. I'm going to add in some blue, start coloring that up, and keep rhyming, apparently. And let's see here, oh, I know what I could do for the red. Let's say the bear has a little teeny house in the, in the woods there, huh? A little cabin and it's a little red cabin. There you go. So now I can add in my red cabin. And in, in this little red cabin, the bear likes to tell stories and eat a lot of honey. Now, I like to say our background, the sky and whatnot here, it's gonna have some blues and purples. And we can have different shades of purples and blues. I could have drawn it in the woods, I guess, but we, we're doing an urban 
an urban bear. An urban bear hunt. And then I'm gonna draw, oop, add in some greenery. And then uh, I am gonna stay with the brown bear, okay? Um, and I'm gonna add some different shades of brown. So I'm using crayon oil pastels and whatnot. And then at the very end, I am gonna blend everything with one color pencil. And like I said before, if you get tired using one hand, you can always use your non-dominant hand and color. And in the process, I am trying to round my item here, my shapes, and just having a good time, okay? No stress, just having a good time. And this idea was inspired because we're walking around and we saw all those bears in the windows and we thought, hey, why can't we draw our own bear and have a good time with this and play along? Plus, that bear song is very fun to sing. Oh, I ran. All right. So I guess I'm gonna go with a nice pink tongue. And then, I'm gonna go with some dark eyes. I'm gonna do some outlining. Let's see here. Rawr. Nice dark snout, dark eyes. Rawr. It's a friendly bear, okay? Nice friendly bear. If you get a chance, you can go on YouTube and pull up the song and there's some real fun drawings of some old folk. Oh, there you go. Some old folk songs and drawn out very nicely, which is kind of fun. All right. I'm going to take a color pencil, one color pencil, I'm going to go with a light blue again, and I'm going to blend my oiled pastels and crayon into those white spaces that aren't filled up, and just make this drawing more of a solid piece. And then I hope that when people walk by, they'll be able to see our little drawing in the window. That might actually lead to the next idea. Maybe we draw a puppy next time and be like, a puppy in the window. But we're gonna focus on the bear and finish today with the bear. Or maybe next time we could do a bear with a musical instrument and that would be our our session for Thursday. Let's keep playing with this idea of the bear hunt and keep drawing some bears. The next one would be a bear with music. And maybe that bear with the guitar is walking a puppy. How about that one? That might be kind of fun. And that's just a quick idea. Again, I'd love to see what you draw. Post it up on YouTube 
and put it in your windows. All right, thank you for doing art with me. I truly enjoy doing art and sharing it with you guys. Yay!